Hello everybody, welcome to Snehal Rakesh 24 show. Today I'm going to talk about water retention, cellulite and benefits of herbalized cellulose. Water retention occurs when there is excess fluid build up in our body. 90% of the water retention is just beneath the surface of the skin. Whereas cellulite is the fat deposit beneath the skin. It is what gives our skin the dimpled effect. It is also called the orange peel skin. It is basically a layer of fat which covers specific areas on our body like our arms, our stomach, our buttocks and our thighs. And it won't seem to disappear no matter how little we eat or how much we exercise. Water retention can be present with cellulite underneath. Most of us have a combination of two. But if you want to improve both these conditions, then water retention has to be addressed first. Actually, most individuals have experienced water retention at one time or another. Especially when we have the Indian version of Chinese food, where they add a lot of ajinomoto and salt. And because it has high sodium, it attracts a lot of water and it causes water retention. And that's why when we have the Indian version of Chinese food, we get up next day having a lot of puffiness on our body. But water retention is especially prevalent in women, mostly during their menstrual cycle. Some other factors contributing to water retention are high intake of table salt, refined sugar and processed food, hormonal imbalance, improper high intensity or high impact exercises, stress and not enough water intake. You can tell the difference between water retention and cellulite by absence or presence of dimples. I can show you four different ways to check if you are dealing with water retention or cellulite. The first thing that you can do is what if whatever it seems like a dimple, gently lift the skin above that dimple. If the dimple stays, then it is cellulite. And if the dimple disappears, then it is water retention. The second thing that you can do is perform the flick test on the affected area. You can gently flick the skin. If you see ripples similar to dropping a pebble in a pool of water, then it is water retention. The third thing that you can do is lie flat black on your back and lift your legs be perpendicular to your body and if you see all the dimpling falling down then it is water retention. The fourth thing that you can do is feel the tissue gently press the skin on the affected area and if the skin feels hard and dense then it is cellulite and if the skin feels soft and mushy then it is water retention. Some tips to improve water retention are reduce intake of table salt, refined sugar and processed food, sleep well and meditate to improve hormonal imbalance and stress. Try cold water showers as it helps to improve water retention. Drink at least 3 liters of water every day. Do low impact exercises like brisk walk, swimming, low intensity steady state cardio and weight training. So now let me tell you how herbalized cellulose can help you to improve water retention. Cellulose has corn silk as an active ingredient. Corn silk is nothing but when you eat a tree, you can see that the cover of the cover of the tree is a golden thread like something like that. That is corn silk. So corn silk is actually a natural diuret. And what it does is it helps to maintain the fluid balance in our body by excreting excess fluid. So that's how you know, corn silk helps us to improve water retention. So cellulose has actually 90 tablets. So you can take one tablet thrice a day along with your meals. So start using cellulose along with the tips that I gave you and let me know how your water retention is improving.